let's talk foundation. All right, I have a concealer on just under my eyes right here. And when you apply concealer, don't just go like that. You wanna go like an upside down triangle. Now, all right, we have several types of foundation. Uh, we've got our BB Flawless, which is a tinted moisturizer. This is great for those that just want light coverage that maybe have dry skin and want a dewy finish. This is great, it's just light coverage, but it feels great, It's I've used it before, I love it. Next, you have your powder foundation, which I absolutely love. I use powder foundation almost all the time. This is especially good for those with oily skin. Uh, I have dry skin, but I still love to use it. And then we have our li touch liquid foundation, which is what I recommend for just about everybody because it works for all skin types, it dries to a powder finish, and it's so lightweight, buildable, and great coverage. I'm gonna show you just how to use it. You're gonna shake it up. We also have a cream foundation. It's not my favorite, so I don't really recommend that. Um, unless you have really super, super, super dry skin and you want a really heavy coverage. But for the most part, I think this is your, this is most, everybody loves this. This is an incredible foundation. You shake it up really well and squeeze out the foundation in the dropper. I'm gonna take it out and I'm gonna try about three drops around the edge. Not inside, but just around the edge. So that was a little bit more. And just gonna dab it on. This is so blendable. So start light and you can always add more. I don't need a lot of coverage, so less is more for me and just do circular motions. I just washed my brush, so the bristles are a little stiff, so there we go, loosen them up. This is a very soft tool. I really like this brush. So I'm just gently massaging the makeup and into my skin. And I have videos where this actually covers our waterproof black eyeliner pencil. I have to use a little bit more to do that, but it does do it. Now this isn't full coverage, it's medium coverage, but it does give us excellent, I mean, I've got some really good coverage out of it. So anything else that isn't covered, you can use the concealer for, which is incredible. Can, our concealer can cover tattoos. It's just amazing. I don't have high need for concealer, so, but I do like the way it makes me look when I put it under the eyes here for my pictures. It really helps my um, pictures to look flawless. To, it looks like I have a filter on, and I don't. I never use filters on my photos. It's just amazing foundation. <laughs> so we'll get that blended in, and what I love about this is it's so lightweight. I stopped wearing foundation. I experimented a little bit when I was younger, and what I ended up not liking is that it felt so cakey and gross. Felt like it was just, you know, making my face break out more and so I hated it and so I just stopped wearing it and so it took me a while to get into foundation but when I after a while I tried it and it's so soft this dries to a powder finish I can't tell I'm wearing it it's lightweight it looks incredible and so I mean it just solves all those problems you don't have cakey it's breathable lightweight looks amazing and you only need three to five drops for your face pretty incredible so that is my go-to recommendation for you. If you need a color match, let me know. Bye.